Hey guys, what is up? Max Kiter, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to check out this mod called Birth of the Rebellion. So basically, this is uh, this map takes place at you know the converge the Battlefront One Bespin, uh, what is it called? Oh yeah, Bespin Cloud City, not the platforms one. And yeah, you got two sides, the Imperials and Codus Militia. And yeah, this mod really shines on the Coda, Coda's militia uh, side of things. Uh, the Imperials, they cosmetically they look pretty much the same. Uh, they got new, they got uh, like other special classes such as uh, this guy. Uh, basically, that's that's the Imperial Clone Commando, and there's another one called the Imperial Purge Trooper, which is basically basically like an overgrown Dark Trooper. Reminds me a lot of the Dark Trooper from Elite Squadron. Actually, we'll see them later. But yeah, this class really shines at the militia, though. Wait, let me take out this dude with the jetpack. But the map, uh, it's not nothing, nothing too special about it. It's the Bespin Cloud City map. Oh, I'm on fire, damn it! Ah, man, it's been quite the hectic week for me. Not gonna lie. Oh yeah, by the way, have you guys seen Batman v Superman? If you have, let me know in the comment section below. Lots of, there's quite a divide in that film. <laughs> They're losing reinforcements. Nice, nice. I want, I like, uh, first I wanted to, like, make two videos of, of this mod and, like, showcase the other classes, but I'm not sure if I want to. Um, like, like I said before, nothing too special on the Imperial side of things. Come on, die! Da, 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 hey. Oh, we need to get some kills fast. I want to show you guys the other classes. Da, 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 What's the Imperial approach? Bro, oh, there it is. See, he's, he's an overgrown dark trooper. He walks like a zombie. He walks like a character from Coder. <laughs> Oh, Imperial Officer. So that's something different about this version of Best Spin Cloud City, but I can't point my finger at it. I don't know what it is. I think it's the texture. They they look a bit dry. If you know if you guys catch my meaning. Oh dear my Oh we got killed. You know who knew I'll be uh, uh, who knew like I'll uh, I'm still you know, playing this game. Never in my life have I imagined that I'd be playing Star Spout from 10 years after it is released. Now that's what you call longevity. <laughs> okay, so this is, uh... Okay, I honestly forgot what this class is called. Uh, basically, uh, we have, we have the, this uh, D817 Carbine. We also got this really nice uh, energized stun bit baton, which is weird. It doesn't look like a, like a baton to me. More like a force spike or an electro zord, electro staff. I mean, uh, in Elite Squadron, it's called an uh, a force spike. And I've been, uh, actually, by the way, guys, I've been thinking to make uh, you know to play Elite Squadron again on my channel since I think you guys really enjoyed that game in my channel. And speaking of Elite Squadron, uh, I think you guys. Are aware that this there's a fan project called uh, Star Wars Galaxy in Turmoil. Basically, they they are um they're trying to recreate uh, the canceled Free Radical Battlefront Three, and it looks pretty cool. Like you should follow those guys on Twitter. They're making some pretty cool progress. No release dates yet, though. Hopefully that game gets made because I really want to see basically Elite Squadron HD. Even that I'm already happy, but this game, this project seems to be focused on a bigger scale though, so that's nice. And I really like this dude, by the way. Do the energized stun baton. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Oh, it's the overgrown perch shooter. Oh my god, he's like a freaking gorilla. Gorilla! Yep, but he's dead. Oh, damn! Wait, I'm gonna show you guys the commander. 
or the, the commando, sorry. I think too much in the aerial trooper though, that's just basically like, um, basically like a rebel version of the Battlefront Extreme Jet Trooper class. You know, a jetpack and a bowcaster. The semi auto rifle though. Wait, I'm gonna have some fun with this. Oh no, 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 oh god, I landed like right on top of him and I'm. Haha. <laughs> hey, don't you shoot at me. Oh, did that grenade just stick on me? Yeah, it did stick on me. <laughs> oh dear, my. When you got 10 guys left to kill, should be f quite easy. Hey. Come on, let me kill you, let me kill you. Let me. Ha <laughs> You got this rocket launcher attachment. A concussion grenade. Oh, it's thick. It's thick on him. I like that. Wait, let me. I want to do something cheeky. Nope. Wait, let me try something. No, damn! I wanna, I wanna hit that turret so bad. Hey, come on. Oh, direct hit. That is how you do it, boys. Uh, just, just do it quickly. <laughs> oh, that was the last kill. Okay, let's see our score. Okay, you got 31 kills, you died about 5 times for awards, you got killing spree, public enemy, and dead eye. Okay, cool. So yeah, that was the Birth of the Rebellion mod by AQT, I think the mod creator's name. Yeah, AQT. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And of course, subscribe to the channel for more quality stars content. Anyways, Max Kydra, signing off. Peace.